all know that the boar farm is by far the best method in this game in earning that tracking and skinning XP. It is utterly crazy, but it does require you to be somewhere around that same level of the boars, which is a level 45, or you need to be in a team to make the most out of it. Well today guys I bring you a method in earning tons of skinning and tracking XP while playing solo and you can do this easily if you're around that level of a 25 to a 30 and there after. How's it going guys my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. Okay so the way skinning works is pretty simple. The higher the enemy class in most cases the more skin XP you get. But once you get to a level 70, the method today really starts and we will see you fly past that 100 mark and up to a 200 mark in no time at all. But you do need to get to a level 70 first and a few tips I have in getting to that level 70 mark are straightforward ones. Obviously the better the tools you have the more efficient it becomes. So do what you can to either buy or craft better tools. Also, you want to be farming in that area where your territory standings, gathering speed bonuses are highest. Then I'd probably say look for wolves, wildcats and boars, as these are most apparent closer to those towns. I mean, you can hunt bigger animals like elk, but the most efficient way is obviously killing and skinning more of less here yeah, because the amount of wolves that are around, it just makes it way more efficient and faster for you. I mean, yes, you will get more from an elk, but by the time you find and skin an elk, you'll probably kill 15 or 20 wolves. So yes, I literally skinned wolves outside of Monarch's Bluff up to a level 70, and it wasn't too bad whatsoever. Okay, so when you reach that golden mark of a level 70 skin and tracking, this is where that skin and tracking XP starts to become a lot easier to earn. So you want to head into Cutlass Keys. And if you can, fast travel to this point right here, the Bridge of Nowhere. If you can't, you'll have to run down. From here, head straight to the Balmy Vault area. Once you are within this area, there are tons of enemies here called Lush Hunt Pointers. These crazy looking dog like creatures, these are a level 34, but they are super easy to kill, and these reward you amazing skinning and tracking XP when skinned. But these creatures require you to be a level 70, hence, get into a level 70 before heading here. Now these Lush Hunter pointers reward you almost 670 tracking and skin XP per one. But within this area there are wild cats and wild boars, these also give you 600 tracking and skin XP and they are also all over the place. So yes guys, do this until you get bored, but it is by far one of the better solo tracking and skin XP farms in this game. Again though, nothing really beats the boar farm, but that does require more from you. This is amazing for that solo player, so yes, I hope it helps you out. If it does, leaving a like really helps me out. If you're new around here and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.